okay what is going on everybody what is up ld here and it's time for another channel update so we actually just talk about um i'm thinking about doing a new let's play of a sega game of a sega like a game made by sega but i have some ideas in mind but i need you guys you know opinion on what you would rather want to see the games i have in mind are First of all, Knight's Journey of Dreams for the Wii. I have the game right here. It's on my dresser right now. I have the game, Knight's Journey of Dreams. I can let's play it. And I've also let's play Knight's Journey Into Dreams, the Xbox Live Arcade um, remastered game. I've let's played that. And I'm really eager to let's, to um, play this game. I haven't played it yet. And it's supposed to be like a new story. I don't really know, but... um. I know who Nice is. I know who Nice is, but it's supposed to be a new story of Nice going at actually into the the human world, and she's like, um, not she's not a he or she, but um, uh, it's um, let's just say he he's um, you know, saving the world stuff like that. It's actually have a, a really good story right here, and I haven't played it yet, so I'm, I really really, really want to play this. So if you guys want to see me let's play this, please let me know. My other. Game on I want to let's play is Billy Hatcher and the Giant Egg. Some of you guys might not know what this game is because it's it's only it doesn't have its own series. It's only one it's only um a one a standalone game like it only has one game. Billy Hatcher is basically a, a a guy and his other friends who have to save I guess their region of the road I guess from you know, I guess taken over by some evil. I forget the story because it's been years since I beat the game, played the beat, played the game. But the game is really, really good. It has cameo Sonic characters in it. We played the multiplayer has Sonic characters in the game, like Sonic Tails, Knuckles, stuff like that. The game is really, really good. It's really, really good. I like the story, I like the gameplay. It's really, really good. So I will want to let's play this again. Um, you guys tell me what you want, what, like what you want me to play. Would you rather me play this? Bully Hatcher and the Giant Egg. Would you rather be or would you rather me play Night and Journey of Dreams? And I have another game that I'm thinking about less playing. Well, games. Let's go to refer to game stuff real quick. It's made by Sega. It's. I can zoom in. Hazune Miku. I should actually look at the PS3 versions because I can't let's play on a 3DS and I don't have the Vita. And the PS4 version is not even out yet. So let's go to the. PS3. Okay, so I'm thinking about let's play Hatsune Miku Project Diva F. Now I played the demo on the PlayStation Network. I mean, it's a rhythm game. I'm. It's like Space Channel Five in a way. Space Channel Five is actually um you know a rhythm game, a beat rhythm game like this. But Space Channel Five, let's put Space Channel Five is more funner because I like the Space Channel Five series. But I mean, this is made by Sega. Sega America, Sega. I'm guessing this is a Sega from Japan or something like that, or Europe or whatever. But it's made by Sega, and um, you know, I'm willing to check it out. I'm really checking it out because it's made by Sega, and you know, people might like it, people might not like it. People, I think there's a huge fan group of Vocaloids. Vocaloids are musical androids, or androids are like um, sings music, sings stuff like that. And Miku is a Vocaloid. I don't know if I'm saying it right, or I don't know if I'm using the right term, but she's a Vocaloid. This was meaning that she's not a human being, she's not a cyber, she's an android, she's a, she's a, she's made from mechanical parts, she was never human being, she's just an android, and um, yeah, I'm thinking about, I don't know about us playing this, if I do, if I do, um, do a play of it, it might just be no commentary, because, um, I mean, it might be commentary, because it's a rhythm game, like, people will probably want to hear me, well, people will probably want to hear the music than to be hearing my commentary because it's a musical game and people, I guess, wouldn't really want to hear the commentary because they be more focused on the music and the beat and stuff like that and the the and the, and the um the video. So if I do play this, I probably I most likely won't do commentary. I most likely won't. I probably will because people will probably be, um, you know, eager to hear my funny reactions of a missing, you know, the icons and getting stuff wrong. Cause it's very easy to lose in this game. It's it's not an easy game whatsoever. Either one of these, like, cause I played the demo of it on PS the PS3 PSN network, 
So I might let's play that, and that's one more game I I might let's play. Well, not yeah, kind of let's play. Um, let's go here. Let's go to um this type right here. Just type it right here. S Samba. D amigo. For the Wii. I might let's play some of the Amigo for the Wii. Um, like I said, the game is very, very, very cheap. It's very cheap. I can get it on eBay. Preferable, I prefer to get it from GameStop.com because I can get points from GameStop.com and it's cheaper on GameStop.com. I get it from GameStop.com and have it come to the mail next week. So this is an option, but I mean, it's not an adventure game. I think it's a, I, I, I think it's a, a musical game, kind of honestly. I haven't played it before, but I think it's a musical game based off of its reiteration reiteration from the Sega game such as Sega Superstars Tennis and stuff like that. I think it's a musical game and yeah. So I can let's play Samo D Amigo. Um the Hatsune uh, one of the Hatsune Miku games. Nice Journey of Dreams and Billy Hatcher. Argadu um one guy recommended that I let's play um Arcadia Skies of Arcadia. Let me, let me um Google this or oh, Bing it. I don't know why Bing is the recommended, the default search engine. Um, skies. Uh, Arcadia. A guy in my last channel update. Um, one he recommended I play Skies of Arcadia. I mean, I looked at the game. I thought about it, but the game is very expensive. It's very, very, very expensive, and it's very rare. They have a GameCube version that, like I said, very expensive, very, very rare, and, um, you know, that being is RPG, like, look at that GameCube version, um, you know, fifty fifty seven dollars is bit, it's not even over yet, that's not, it's, that's not the final price yet, look, like, look at this, a hundred bucks, game, um, Dreamcast version, eighty five dollars, um, thirty dollars, GameCube, game, Dreamcast version, like like I said, the game is very expensive and um I don't wanna I also don't wanna let's play it because it's an RPG and I know RPGs take very long and I don't wanna like um be dedicated for I I I, I don't wanna be um so dedicated to game that to like um play it for like probably like two months just to beat the game and I um that being said I don't have much time and time and at all for real because I um have a job and I go to school and everything like that and I have you know personal life stuff like that so it wouldn't really be um make sense for me to let's play a uh, RPG game that would take so much time and that I wouldn't really have time to do other gameplay videos or other games whatsoever so I'm not gonna do Skies of Arcadia because it's just it'll take too long and it's very expensive so yeah and also this I've thought about buying a Dreamcast because I know there's um there's Dreamcast, Sega games for the Dreamcast. There's a lot of good Dreamcast games like Sonic Shuffle that you can only play on the Dreamcast. Stupid Bing, if it was Google, it'd be much better. Like, Google would have showed a list of Sega games that own a Sega Dreamcast. Like, Bing is so stupid. I hate Bing. But, yeah, there's a lot of good um, Dreamcast games. I'm thinking about buying a, a Dreamcast. A Dreamcast is very cheap to get. It's not very expensive. I can um, get one. I could buy it online and have it come in the mail next week. Um, and probably do some Dreamcast game with play, like Sonic Shuffle. Yeah, I could probably get um Sonic Shuffle or something like that. The original page on the five. Oh, this is this is a good one. Page on the five. I haven't I beaten the the part two, but I haven't played or beaten part one yet. This is this is very interesting. It's page on the five, part one. Oh my god, for the Dreamcast. I mean, oh my god, I, I just want to have this in my hands. I don't even care about playing the game. I just want to have that in my hands. This is just such an iconic and cool game through my eyes. This is. Looks like a gem to my eyes. You guys have no idea. 
So I might get a Dreamcast, but then again, I most likely will let's play one of these games. Either Knights, a Hatsune Miku game, um, Sama the Amigo, or Billy Hatcher. I think people are gonna pick either Nice or Billy Hatcher, but that's up to you guys. I really wanna see what you guys want me to play. I'm really eager to see what you guys want me to play so I can get started on it. I don't wanna pick myself because I don't wanna pick something that um you know a lot of people might not like. So I don't wanna you know I me. Mean? So guys, please let me know or what you wanna see, please, in the comment section below or on Twitter. Like I said, you can um follow me on Twitter by talk to me on Twitter bye um it's if you want to if you want to talk to me like um Twitter is very very convenient if you want to talk to me because it's connected to, to my phone and if someone um someone to tweet to me or anything if I get any notification to Twitter I would immediately have my phone ring because like I said Twitter is connected to my phone what is glitching out hold on uh, I got tabs running on so that's why um so if you want to see me on Twitter you have to do I, you just have to go to my profile, my YouTube channel, and you just click on this link, follow me on Twitter, and you'll go to my Twitter page. And then you can tweet me from there. But, I mean, like I said, please let me know what you want to see me play. Yeah, I've recently done these videos. Please let me know what, what you want to see me play. Um, I'm very eager to get started on, on the first Let's Play. I know I'm right in the middle of Rayman. Of Rayman 3, but... I probably have about um, three parts left of this game, and I can finish it in a flash. Or not in a flash, but I can, um, you know, end this any day I want to. But I just I have been stalling because um, I've been doing this, so I've been like not, you know, I've been neglecting this let's play. So I can get get it done in the in a flash. And I don't know if I'm gonna finish this let's play. I might cancel because I am. I have beaten Dead to This Desert and I am the next level, the next world is a pirate world and it's very hard and I can't do it. I'm sorry, I'm not with my with this with, with these Wii sensors, with these Wii motion controls, I can't play this game. Sure, if I could use the GameCube controller or uh, or the the Wii classic controller or whatever it's called, I can do it, but I can't beat this game with most because I can't. I'm sorry guys, so I'm got to cancel this let's play. Yeah, I'm gonna cancel. Or it's gonna be on def on definite hold, most likely cancel. But I mean, yeah. So I could finish this in like this week if I if I wanted to. But I'm I really want to get started new. Let's play a Sega game. Like like I said, I done nice Billy Hatcher. I got rid of my um nice tab, but whatever. Nice Billy Hatcher, Samba de Amigo or a Hot Two Day Amigo game. Please, guys, let me know in the comment section and. I will be less playing One Piece Burning Blood because the game is coming out the next month. I think it's this month. Is it this week? Yeah, I think, yeah, I think it's late this month. Um, late this month. One Piece Burning Blood. So I'm gonna be less playing that. And yeah, and um, one more thing. The final thing I want to say is I'm going to a Comic Con mid this month. It's Comic Con or in um. Where is Comic Con near where I live? And I will be going to it for the whole weekend. And I'm going to be doing a lot of stuff that's going to be really fun. And I'm going to be cosplaying there. I'm going to be cosplaying as. What on earth? That's crazy. I'm gonna I'm be cosplaying as Pain from Naruto. No, I don't have no, no, I don't have chest pain. It's crazy. Come on, Google. But yeah, I'm gonna be cosplaying as Pain. I got the Akatsuki cloak. I bought the Renegade eyes. The contact list. I bought the Renegade contact list. They're coming in the mail. They should be coming. Today or this week, hopefully. And I bought the the rain headband. And for the for the piercings I've idea, I'm gonna um make my own piercings. Not gonna be real piercings. I'm I, I, I'm just gonna make um some some imitation piercings and them sticking to my nose stuff like that and my ears and I'm gonna and that's how it's gonna be. And like I said, I have the cloak and I have the running on eyes coming in the mail, the contact list. And I have the headband coming in the mail and I have the ring coming in my as well. 
the one thing I don't have is just uh, the shoes, which I, which I can just buy and have it come in the mail next week. So yeah, I'm going to be cosplaying as pain. I know I'm not going to be having orange hair because I'm black and black guys don't really look good with orange hair. I'm probably going to be wearing, I'm probably going to have a white hair, some white spiky hair wig, a white hair wig. Because um, being that I'm black, I'm not white. I probably look best with, with white hair than orange hair. I, um, for a black pain, I can imagine me looking best with white hair. White spiky hair to the orange spiky hair. So yeah, I'll probably get either orange spiky hair or just leave my hair as it because I have an afro. So I might either just either get a, a, a white spiky hair wig or just leave my hair as is and just leave my afro as is, just use my afro. And yeah, I'm going to be pain. I'm really excited. Very excited. I might um, make a video of myself in my room with, with my whole pain cosplay on. I might show myself with the running guy eyes. I'm going to be like, Almighty Push in this house. I'm, gonna, I'm just so excited, guys. I'm going to be going to this Comic Con like um, mid this month. 14. Not the, yeah, no, you know, like it's 14, 16, and 14, 15, and 16 today. 14, 15, and 16. Or door, the 13, 14, and 15. But either way, I'm going to the Comic Con the weekend, that weekend, Friday, Saturday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. So, yeah, um, very excited. Gonna be cosplaying as pain. And, yeah, I'm, I, I, I will make a few videos. Of it, I'll be cosplaying as pain, and um, at the at the, at the Comic Con as well, there should be some tournaments going on, some game tournaments. So I might um do some videos of that, but it won't be my average, you know, normal HD setup like like I do like I'm doing right now. It'll probably just be me using a camera and just recording the TV screen because you know I can't bring my I'm I'm not gonna bring my laptop there and all my setup just to record. I mean I could, but like it's just. That'd be kind of silly, but yeah. So I'm coughing as pain, and I got the running eyes coming in the mail, contact lenses, and yeah, I guess that's it. Like I said, guys, please let me know or what you want me to play out of Knights, Billy Hatcher, Somebody Amigo, and a Hot City Amigo game. I can get a Dreamcast. No, I'm, let's scratch the Dreamcast idea. I'm, I'm not gonna get. I'm, I'm not gonna let's play a Dreamcast game next. I'll probably do that in a month or two. So yeah, but in the meantime, please let me know what Dreamcast games you want. You want. You want me to let's play in the future. But like I said, please let me know on either Knights, Journey of Dreams, Billy, Billy, Billy Hatch and Giant Egg, I have seen a Miku game or some of the Amigo. Which of those games would would you want me to let's play? Please, guys, let me know. The comment section on Twitter. Let me know, please. And thanks. And have a splendid day.